Hi everyone, it's Happy Mail Queen. Today I am back to share a project for my crafty boutique. I did receive a kit from Louisa and um, it is a kit called Tea Time with Teddy and it's super cute. It's very shabby chic. So I created a banner. So I'm going to go ahead and share that with you guys. I used uh, five of the papers and then I fussy cut some ephemeras. I used five beads and two uh, flat back pearls from her little um, kit. I used some of the flowers, just the smaller ones. And then I did use uh, a trim and uh, a lace strip as well as a velvet ribbon and uh, what else and then a couple more ribbons one fabric ribbon and the other one is like a satiny ribbon and I think that's about it and I still have so much left in the kit so let me go ahead and share it with you I did not string it yet um, because it'll be easier to show you so I'm gonna go ahead and start with this one right here how cute is this so I did use a, a die in my stash from Scrap Diva Designs. Um, and as far as the paper, okay, I actually um, put it in my copier. Um, so this is not the original paper in the kit. I copied it because um, I'm going to use the original papers uh to create another project so just to let you know so um i put it at you know high quality or not high what is it best quality on my printer so it still came out a little bit lighter than the original so just letting you know um yeah they all came out a bit light but i figured it's okay because you know i'm gonna um <laughs> put a bunch of um i'm gonna decorate it anyway so um, there you go. If you're interested in how I put this together, I, I will um, put up my process video up uh, at the end if it's if this video is not too long. So that way you can, you know, see what I did. And um, anyway, let's um, move along. <laughs> so this is the paper right here. It has the lavender flowers on it. And um, I did um, die cut um, my paper pieces here and here's the pom-pom um, trim on the top and there's the lace their lace strips that she gave us and then underneath that you can't really see it now but the um, off-white or cream colored uh, ribbon underneath is the velvet ribbon and then this is from my stash. Um, I didn't have enough of the pearls um, that she provided in the kit. So I just used, you know, what I had and I found these. I think these are Alina Craft little pearls, if I'm not mistaken. I fussy cut the bear, um, the flower and the cupcake. And, um, and then I used some stickles. Um, she did give us some rosettes. Um, and I did use the rosette she provided. I did, however, size it down a little bit. And I did that by using um, a circle stitch die. And then this piece right here is actually the journaling cards that she has in the kit. Um, and I did um, die cut the journaling card to make it a circle. This uh, piece here is actually... Um, a chipboard uh, chipboard alphabet letters that I've had for forever <laughs> so I wanted to use up my stash I just flipped it over because I liked this side better so it's this nice blue and um, yeah and then I did my cluster of flowers I put a little bit of gesso I don't know if you can tell just to tone down the uh, color of the flowers a little bit uh, I think I have to put more gesso on this one I'll show you in the other um banners though it's it's a little bit more noticeable um, i used a bead um, all this is from her kit um, the 
ribbon, um, the strips of uh, fabric ribbon that she provided. I used um, <laughs> three of them all up practically um, and I just made a bow and then this is from my stash um, because um, I needed more of the pearls, flat back pearls. Uh, the doily, uh, that's also from my stash. Um, she did provide us with one large doily, but for this project I needed small doilies. So I did um, use this doily from Michael's. It's uh, a peachy color. And then I did um, use a die to cut the um, gold foiled um, teacup. Um, I thought this was appropriate to use because this is uh, tea time with Teddy and um, and then this is also from my stash and what else could I tell you I think that's it um, that's about it that's all I did and I apologize I'm starting with the D um, what I did with my banner is I spelled out Teddy because my dog my dog's name is actually Teddy Bear which I thought was perfect for this project. So I spelled out Teddy, but I showed you the D first. I'm not sure why. So here's the, here's the T for Teddy. And again, I basically did the same thing. As you can see, these are two different um, um, shapes uh, because I used the loaded banner from Scrap Diva Designs this one and I used the, the front panels I used this shape and then I used this shape right here so for this one here I used this pretty blue pattern paper again I copied it so it is muted <laughs> um, this butterfly here I stickled um, I fussy cut that so again everything is part of the kit um, you know, again, it's just the alpha. These um, flat back pearls are not from the kit. And the doily is not from the kit. Um, and this flat back. But aside from that, everything else is from the kit. Um, so I think it came out super cute. So they're all basically the same. I just, you know, changed it up with, you know, like this one has a blue bead instead of the purple bead. And then here's the next one. Look how cute. So uh, the the bears in the in the kit, um, I used the boy bears. So um, it's basically the bears that have the bow on their neck instead of their um, head. And there's only two. So I just kind of alternated between this brown bear and the white bear. The little white polar looking bear. I did um, ink up the edges um, just to make sure that it, you know, stands out. And then I just love her flowers, her flat flowers. Love that one. And that's how this one came out. Super cute, right? And then here is, whoops, I think between this one is this one. So just, um, you know, different pattern paper and color combo. So this one here, I put green. So as you can see, it's gessoed. It's to tone it down a little bit so it's not too bright. And it just makes it more shabby as well. Um, again, I stickled another butterfly. There's um, stickles on this die cut uh, flower again. So... They all came out so stinking cute. And then this is the last one here. Again, here's the brown bear. I used a teapot um, and teacup die cuts. Or, well, I, I fussy cut it. And again, here's the flowers that she provides in the kit as well as the bead. So cute. So, yeah, this is my version of Shabby Chic. <laughs> it's a little, uh, not not so shabby, more chic. Um, but yeah, that's just how I usually do it. So yes, I can't wait to string this and, you know, put it up in my craft room somewhere. I have to find a spot for it, but, um, that is it. That is, um, all of the banner pieces that spells out Teddy. Um, so yeah, stick around. I will do my process video at the end. All right, guys, thanks for watching and check out 
my crafty boutique um hopefully she has more kits i know she had three more kits last week um so but you can um um check out her shop on instagram so that's how you want to purchase it through instagram i'll leave the information in the description box all right guys thanks for watching and i'll see you later bye